Welcome to Technical Drawing. Today we are going to learn this sum in oblique. If you see this, they have given in third angle. Front view is down, top view is up, right? And always remember the view which has circle will be always front view. So first we will draw layout where we will take length 80, height 50 and width 50. So first we'll mark 80. Then height 50. See, I have taken receding angle 45. 80 and 50. You can take 30 also if it is mentioned in the question. You take height 50. Remember one thing, I have taken receding angle 45 degree. 80, 50. Width is how much? 50. Origin is here. Width is 50. So first we will draw this box. So we are done with layout. See, 50, 50. And now if you see in front view, there are two parts, A and B. And in top view, there are many parts. So we'll start with front view, right? But if you see, these two parts are same, A and 1. So always remember, so this is not straight. See this, both are same. So either it has to be a square or a rectangle. If it is not a rectangle, then it has to be inclined. So this part B is inside. See this. How much inside? 10. So it's better to start with part B. See, once again, I'll explain. What you need to see, you need to see part A and B. If you see part A and part 1, both are same. So if both are same and if it is not a square or rectangle, then it has to be inclined. Keep this in mind. Now what I'm doing, I'm taking 10, 10 on both the sides and I'm drawing this middle part, which is 30, to draw part B. Now I'll take midpoint of this, which is 40, and I'll take 25, 25 on both the sides. After that, I'll take 30, 30 behind, See this, this is 30, 30. Now if you see, radius 15. From center we'll cut 15, 15. So we can draw those remaining two lines also. And we can draw circle also. We'll take radius 15. And we'll draw circle. First, we are drawing part B. For that, we started from top view. If you see, these two are dark. This is going behind. This is also going behind. This is dark. Dark. From this center point, P. It's going behind by how much? 30. This is Q. So take this distance from Q. You draw another radius 15. After that you see this height is how much? 30. So you go down by 30. 30. 30. From all three corners. See this 30. This part right? This part is done. So you take 30 from here. Join this line. 
and draw 45 degree. After this, we'll draw part A by simply joining this corner to this corner. See this, and this corner to this corner. See, we got part A or one. Same way you join the behind corner also and draw these two lines dark. So we got the required sum. This is I have taken 45 degree, you can take 30 degree also. It, it is up to the question. Now I can do dimensioning. So always remember whenever two surfaces are same in front view and top view, if it is not a square or rectangle, then it has to be inclined. So that is the main concept which I have explained in this sum. And receding angle, it's up to the question. If they mention 30 degree, you take 30 degree. If it is 45 degree, you take 45 degree. Thank you.